So when I was about 12 or 13 years old, my brother needed a drummer for his band and he taught me just some really basic progressions and then I asked him to teach me to play guitar and then I just was in his band which then I got poached to be in another band then I created my own band and it just slowly snowballed into something that became so normal and so second nature that I don't know anything else. The greatest thing about being in a band for me is two things actually is number two I love recording. It's so, 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 so much fun to have something that has been inside of our brains and it's intangible and then it becomes tangible. It becomes this thing that you can actually hear. It becomes part of this universe now. Um, it's That's so rewarding for me. Um, but hands down, my favorite thing is touring and being on stage. That those few minutes, those 30 minutes to an hour of being there connected with so many other people's energies, it's, if you haven't done it, I recommend it. It's probably one of the best things I've ever had in my life. To be doing what I'm doing today, touring, going overseas, visiting different countries, meeting thousands of new people, that took a lot of, a lot of energy, and it was a long path, and it took a lot of hard work, and a lot of risk, because with trying to pursue something like your dreams is a very, very risky thing to do because there's a big chance of failure and not everybody gets to do what they love. So I'm very fortunate and I know how thankful I am to be here. Um, and even if it wasn't meant to be, I would have still tried because if you don't try, you never know what could become of the future. So, and I still don't know what's gonna become of the future. This may be it, this may be not it. But hopefully, if I keep trying, I'll keep moving forward and I'll keep being able to play music.